We're about 48 days away from April's total solar eclipse. Western New York will experience a few minutes of midday darkness when the moon moves in front of the sun. So while we might be prepared for this once in a lifetime event, some animals could be surprised by the random darkness. New this morning, 7 News reporter Hannah Ferreira talking to the experts, finding out how those animals might react. The countdown continues with less than two months until Buffalo sees a total solar eclipse. And humans aren't the only ones who will experience this unique midday darkness. I checked in with both Lisa Smith from the Buffalo Zoo and Dr. Holly Schreiber from the Buffalo Science Museum to learn more about how our animal friends may react to this heavenly happening. There's a variety of behaviors that animals can exhibit during that time. And we're talking both wild animals and domestic animals. Buffalo hasn't seen a total solar eclipse since 1925 and what better place than the Buffalo Zoo to find out how animals will react. We know that there was a study in 2017 at the Riverbank Zoo and we're going to try to replicate that study here a little bit on grounds uh, to see what the animals are going to do because there's not a lot of information. The zoo will be open on April 8th during the eclipse. Uh, all the animals will have access indoors and outdoors as they normally would, but we don't expect there to be a lot of um, anxiety or anxiousness or running around because they're scared or anything. And around 318 in the afternoon, expect totality. In other words, your furry friends might be getting ready for bed. There are some stories where dogs and cats start that evening routine. They think it's nighttime. They I think it's their normal um, end of day routine. And this applies to all types of animals. If you happen to be on a farm that day, you may see during totality, during that maximum darkness, you may see cows returning to the barns, you may see um, chickens going to roost. Now, while the animals can't wear protective eclipse glasses like you or I can, they do have some natural ways that they can protect their eyes from the sun. People need the safety glasses to be safe, but the animals are used to it. They won't need it. And once the day goes back to normal, you can expect some critter confusion. Anecdotally, um, what, what people have seen in previous eclipses, that when the sun comes out again, after only a few minutes, they're, they're thrown off. Like, ooh, what happened? Hannah Ferreira, 7 News, Buffalo.